Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody, let's take a look at the gold market uh, right now. So, on the gold market situation slightly is changing and although theoretically uh, gold still has chances on the possible upside ABCD pattern to the 1280 lows and uh, has real, real chances to reach the weekly pivot, uh, sorry, monthly pivot point and this resistance but action in the real, 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 on the recent couple of sessions and today also uh, has increased some chances on the, uh, or better to say, re reduces the chances on the appearing of this ABCD pattern. Particularly speaking, if you'll take a look at the daily chart, you will see the signs of the bearish dynamic pressure because on the daily chart of the gold trend has shifted bullish, but price action recently hasn't confirmed it and continue move lower. Usually, this uh, action when the market just creeps with the MACD predictor very often. Uh, leads to the taking out of the previous laws and the, if this really will happen in this case uh, market market will be able to continue move to the uh, lower targets and uh, particular speaking as we have discussed this possible uh, butterfly pattern and uh, possible reaching of the 11 18 area so next next target short term target on the gold market uh, some also, uh, on the intraday charts, we have discussed this. Uh, if I take a look at the forward time frame chart, uh, every day, every day I show you different butterflies, but both of these patterns are still valid. So as you can see, today I have drawn this butterfly by. Just to remind you why we talk about 11.18. So that's 127 of this butterfly pattern. Uh, yes, we have discussed this butterfly to the upside right to the 12 even area and uh, it hasn't been broken yet but today I have drawn this pattern because market shown a bit showing a bit uh, action that it's not really fascinating for possible rebound and right now you all understand what I'm talking about theoretically as we said these laws is the crucial one for this potential butterfly. So uh, this could be the left wing, okay? That could be the right wing with the upside butterfly to the upside. And until these laws hold, the chances that butterfly will work exist. But yesterday we said that market has formed three drive buy pattern. I will show you on the other chart. Here was our three drive buy. This was first drive, second drive, third drive, and here we said. If you would like to take the long position, you could think about it right now because that's the best chance to do this as market stands very close to the 11.43 invalidation point and hardly we will get better opportunity for taking long position because you have the pattern on your back. You have the position that's very close to the invalidation point. And in the first stage, market has shown really nice action, nice appreciation. I hope, guys, that uh, you, keep, uh, you, you have used this chance for moving your stop to the break even. The market has turned move up, but later, when the data on the United States uh, jobless claims has confirmed that the uh, claims on the unemployment stands at the 14, 14 years lows, although they were a bit higher than expected, market has shown this plunge down. Uh, theoretically, right now we could speak about the possible ABCD pattern that market could complete it. It's approximately. 11.88 and uh, you can see market is also has formed this butterfly 11.88 will give us some kind of the regardless triple to buy right it's good, it could be initial thrust ABCD retracement down to the 11.88 and uh, maybe market still could reestablish move to the upside with our butterfly to the upside right that's the final moment but at the same time guys we have this one right we have in fact uh, the failure of the three drive patron 
because it has hasn't led market to the upside reversal. And take a look at this ABCD patient by itself. So we'll take a look at the hourly chart. You will see that on the CD leg we have the acceleration down. It usually means that market will not stop finally at the 100% completion point and probably will proceed to the next target. And in this case, market will take out of the 1143 lows, and this could lead to the failure of this potential upside butterfly target. That's why uh, I'm not really sure that we will get finally the upside reversal. For me, this mostly li looks like the inability market to start upside action after the three drive pattern makes me think that. We should start to think about the failure here and a possible downward continuation rather than uh, speaking about the possible support here and reversal to the upside. Uh, somehow I suspect that uh, that was the final, th th that was the crucial point. This market was, was unable to start upside action and fail and here we see this acceleration down that usually leads to deeper target. It's not just the ABCD, but will be maybe a 1618 ABCD or something of that sort. And anyway, this will lead to the breakout of this loss. So uh, currently, although it seems at the first glance attractive, so this is ABCD, currently it's triple to buy, and this really even close point to the invalidation level, right? Currently, it looks attra attractive for possible taking the long position, but in fact, this chance is worse than this one. Because this chance is appearing already after the failure of the first chance, after the failure of the bullish pattern, and right after the acceleration to the downside. And although this level is closer to invalidation point, uh, by the probability standpoint, this chance is worse than this one. That's why, guys, I think that it's better to stay off or, or, or from uh, taking the long position. And uh, it, it's better to wait what will happen. And if market will pass through these lows, it's better to think about the taking rather short position rather than taking, uh, thinking about the taking long around this level. So we just warn you about the, uh, of the consequences, of the possible taking long position right here. So be extra careful if you still would like to uh, take bet on the possible appreciation of the gold market right from this level. We can't say that this will that's, it will not happen. The, this, the trading is, is the question of the probabilities. And uh, sometimes it happens that, that the, uh, although probability such as downward action, market still uh, turning to the upside and uh, upside action has happened. But uh, we should deal with the probabilities. And currently probabilities suggest that the downward action is more has more chances. And that's why my personal view is that better to stay uh, off from the taking the long position here, and better to be start start the preparation for the possible taking short position for further downward continuation. Because overall recent action uh, absolutely um, looks doesn't skin and, and um, absolutely do not trigger us for uh, possible taking the long position here based on what we have seen what we see right now on the gold market so let's see what will happen besides today's Friday maybe uh, statistics on the United States will uh, let us to come to the final conclusion on the gold market we'll take a look at this market on the weekend and trying to understand what we should expect from the gold on the next week